Hey guys, my name is Malcolm. We're here at SLS 20 in Phoenix, Arizona. And we're just gonna go walking around the convention center asking some people questions. So I have a question for you. In dating, should girls make the first move? Girls make the first move? Um, I'm open to it. I think the one of the women I dated was bold enough. She made the first move. She doesn't claim that she did, but if we were to go on a technicality, she did. And uh, we ended up dating for about a year. Uh, the question I have for you is, in dating, should girls make the first move? Oh, that's a really good question. Um, past me would say, sure, but now I'm like, nah, I think the guy should do it. The guy should do it. Okay, so why is that? He's the leader in the relationship. Oh, that's, yeah. Yeah, he's the leader, man. Let him lead. Well, I don't think guys need to, but I think guys need to take the initiative in the relationship because women look look up to male the male role model so like in like a family the father is always like the main figure that the woman looks up to and so like the woman can make the first move but i think the guy should make the first move because our masculinity it like men women look up to men and if they see a guy that's like strong in his faith that takes the initiative that's a lot more attractive to a woman i don't think it matters. I think it should be open to like if the girl wants to make the first move or the guy. Um, yeah, I think I'm open to like both because um, I know there's some guys that are really shy, but I also know there's some girls that are really shy. So like my ex, we dated for six years. Um, he made the first move, but there's this guy I'm like kind of talking to. I made the first move. So I don't know. I'm like kind of in between. Uh, the question I have for you is in dating, should girls make the first move? Uh, so I think it's perfectly okay for girls to make the first move in their like dating relationship as long as they're not the ones making the only moves. I think it's really important to remember that relationships are a mutual pursuit of each other. Um, so it doesn't really matter like who makes the first move. It's more of a matter of like people like mutually like going for each other and like pursuing each other and making sure they equally want each other. So it's like a hundred percent effort on both parts. Yes, it's not fifty fifty. It's a hundred a hundred. Is there like? a way of going about that like for asking people out yeah so I've done it <laughs> yeah I've kind of like been bold and I don't ask guys on dates because I get nervous by saying the word date I'll admit to that um, but if I want to get to know someone better I'll be like hey like oh do you want to like go grab lunch or like go grab a snack somewhere and just like hang out um, like I'm totally fine with taking that initiative and then I sort of like gauge it from there to see if there's like any mutual interest and that's how I like decide whether or not to keep like pursuing it in a romantic context. So if they are interested, what's the next step? The next step is to let them pursue me as well. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah. Great. Well, thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it.